Hi guys, I just wanted to share a scripture with you guys that was on my heart from my past week's scriptures. Uh, it's found in 1 Thessalonians 5.14. It reads, And we urge you, brothers, admonish the idle, encourage the faint-hearted, help the weak, and be patient with them all. I thought this was a powerful scripture. Uh, when we think about the one another, our brothers and sisters in Christ and how we do life together, uh, life is going to consist of different ups and downs, circumstances, you know, the Bible tells us that this race that we're in is not won by the swift, but for those who can endure. And so we're going to have those times where we may become idle, we become faint-hearted. These different things are going to happen. And that's why I think God gave us one another. He gave us friends to help us on this journey. So I want to encourage you today to be an encourager to your friends. If you're one of the people who are feeling that you may be stagnant in your walk today, or you may be feeling faint-hearted, I hope this uh, was going to encourage you today. You know, the thing about it is that God is ultimately our judge. He's the one who judges us. And I think a friend has to be able to have discernment, you know, when to correct someone when they're wrong, when to encourage them. And this is why it's so awesome that we have the Holy Spirit to help us. So if you have a friend who's in this situation, I want to encourage you to be an encourager to them. You know, sometimes I, it's, it's like I kind of envision things. Imagine we're all in a car. Everybody has their own vehicle. And we're like on this journey you know, becoming sanctified, becoming more like Jesus in our Christian walk. Well, guess what? There's going to be somebody on the side of the road that had a flat. There's going to be somebody who engine is running hot, you know, and what do you do when you're driving by? You know, we're supposed to stop and we're supposed to help our sister, help our brother so they can get back on the main road to continue on this journey. The enemy continues to throw different things at us, you know, whether it's a, 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 a death in the family, loss of a job, whether it's uh, an addiction that we may be dealing with, there's going to be all kinds of things that we're going to encounter in this life. There's going to be trials, there's going to be tribulations. And so God wants our friendships to come alongside of one another to really help each other on this journey. I believe this was God's idea from the beginning, you know, when he created all of us, is to help each other on our walk. And so I want to encourage you today to be an encourager to your friends and you know have eyes to see and ask the Holy Spirit to show you you know where in your life where you may be struggling and if you are struggling you know ask a friend to come alongside you to help you and if you see someone else who may be struggling their walk help them you know when I think about love and I think about the different things that we deal with in this life you know the love that we have for one another will truly show the love that we have for God so I hope this message short message encourage you guys today take care God bless